Hey guys, and welcome back to my channel. If you are new, then welcome. My name is Jillian, and today I am going to be doing a deep clean organizing of one of my closets. The particular closet that I am about to clean out and organize is the closet that is underneath my stairs. If you guys have been following me for a while, you would have seen me clean out this same exact closet a few months ago. I think it was sometime over the summer that I did film a video of me cleaning and organizing out that closet. Now, I don't think it's as messy as the first time around, but it is still super messy. Again, I was hesitant on even sharing this with you guys because I don't want to show you guys how I've let it get out of control, but this is real life. I want to show you guys that I am not perfect and I do let a lot of things get out of control and I put on the back burner. So it is now time to get that closet under control. I have a lot of my yearly decor stuff thrown in there because as you guys can see, I do still have a lot of my fall decor items out. So that is where all of my yearly decor items is. Also, I have a lot of like Target bags and Walmart bags of holiday stuff that I'm planning to put out once Thanksgiving comes around. I do start putting all my Christmas stuff out on Thanksgiving. So all those bags are in there and then Ryan's craft stuff and workbooks are in that closet as well. So he's always going in there pulling out stuff and he usually doesn't put it in the correct spot. He just throws it in. So yeah, it is a big mess. I am tired of falling over and not finding things. So I'm going to clean that out, organize it as best as possible. And this time, hopefully it lasts. So I thought I would record myself cleaning and organizing out that closet and maybe it will give you guys a little bit of motivation to get something done in your house that you guys have been putting on the back burner, whether it is something that you need to clean out like a closet or your garage, your bedroom, whatever it is, I'm hoping that this will give you a little bit of motivation to get up and tackle whatever area you need to get done. So now let's just jump right into me cleaning out my closet. All right guys, so this is how my closet is looking. I know it looks horrible, it is horrific, and it's time to get it under control and get it nice and organized and cleaned out so I can be able to walk around. As you guys can see, there's a ton of random stuff just thrown in this closet. This is definitely the closet that we tend to throw any junk that's laying around the house, so it's time to get it nice and clean. All right, guys, so first things first, I do want to apologize for the lighting. It is horrible. The first, I would say like 45 seconds of this video, I didn't realize how orange it was. I do record and edit from my phone. So sometimes the lighting just is not in my favor. So I do apologize for that, but it will get better after I would say about 45 seconds. So as you guys can see right now, I am literally pulling everything out of the closet. Once I pull everything out, I will go through everything, throw anything away that needs to be thrown out that is either broken or just trash. Then I will start organizing everything. And if it does not belong in the closet, I will put it in its place where it should be. Then once I pull everything out, I will sweep and mop the floors before I place everything back into the closet.
And now, as you guys can see, I am just going to start going through everything that I pulled out of the closet and I'm going to start throwing anything out that is trash, broken, or I just do not need anymore. And then I will start organizing everything where it should be. I am going to be doing a lot of DIYs and crafts. So you're going to see I'm throwing a lot of things in one large Target bag because they are crafts that I plan on doing within the next week or so. So here I am just going through all the bags and making sure that they are in the correct spot. So I'm not sure why it did not record when I was sweeping out the closet, but I did sweep out the closet. But like I said, for some reason it did not record. And then right there you saw me mopping the closet. Now that it is all swept up and mopped up, I'm just going to start placing everything back in the closet and trying to organize it as best as possible. As I told you guys before, I do have a lot of things in this closet that will not be there forever. I just have it stored in there until the holidays are over. And then once the holidays are over, then a lot of the decor items will be pulled out because it is my yearly year round decor. So this is me just trying to get everything nice and organized as possible. And this is the end result of how the closet is looking. Like I mentioned before, it is definitely not perfect, but at least I can walk around in it and things are not completely piled up. Now over here in the corner in that large Target bag, I do have a lot of DIY things I will be doing in the next week or so. Then next to that, I have a bunch of stuff piled up. That is all my year round decor items that is just sitting in there until fall, Christmas, and Thanksgiving is over. Then all that will be pulled out. Then in the corner, I do have a lot of the kids craft and school supplies. And then all the way to the left hand corner, I have all of my craft DIYing stuff. As you guys can see, I definitely need to buy some more storage because I have so much that it does not fit into the drawers. But this is the end results of how everything looks. All right, guys, so that is going to end my closet organization. As you guys can see, it looks so much better than before. I can actually walk in my closet and find things and hopefully it will last. It will stay like that for a while. It won't be as crammed once the holidays is over because then all that decor will be pulled out of there and then my holiday decor will be put in the attic. So right now there is a lot of things in there that will not be in there once the new year starts, once I start putting away all of my other holiday decor items. But for now, 
that is how it's going to stay. It is functional and I could walk in there. So hopefully you guys enjoyed today's clean and organize with me. If you guys enjoyed today's video, give it a thumbs up. Also subscribe and turn on your notification bell if you guys have not already. I would love to have you join my YouTube family if you are not already a part of it. Also guys, comment down below. I have been thinking about doing a clean with me with my car. I've never done a cleaning video where I clean out my car. But I've been thinking about doing it lately, but I'm not sure if you guys would like to see that because like I said, I've never filmed a video on my car and me cleaning it. I would only do the inside of my car because usually my husband will wash the outside for me. So comment down below and let me know if that would be something that you guys would be interested in and maybe I can film that cleaning video next and get it up for you guys soon. As always, thank you so much for watching today's video. I hope you guys have an amazing rest of your day and I will see you guys next time. Bye.